Hmm. Hey, what's up, guys? Scares here. Oh, yeah, that's the area I... Oh, yeah! The frickin' monkeys. Uh, hi, um... Alright. There are monkeys, and I will kill them all. Here's the idea, right? Monkey. Anyway, I will absolutely slaughter all the monkeys. Try it, dude. I'll kill you. Here's, here's the idea, right? If I stand over this lava patch, then they will jump into the lava. They will end up flinging themselves straight into the lava. Is the idea. Actually, it's not going to work out quite like that. But if I shoot them while they're over the lava, then they will absolutely just jump straight into the lava. Which is the easiest way to be rid of them. If I'm being H, which I am. And... Oh, how did... What the hell? That should have been on the ground. Whatever. And hey, I have to... I don't have to watch that anymore. Okay, actually, they straight up did not... Kind of ate my shot, but not really. That's fine. Whatever. Rarely do the monkeys actually... Um... Spawn right in the sides. We'll see. We will see. Shoot, 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 shoot. Yes, I do need to be shooting. Be rooting. Be shooting. Be rooting. Be tooting. And you best darn be shooting. But be kind. Shoot. Try it, dudes. Yep. This is how the game works. This is how monkey. This is how monkey. <laughs> how to monkey. Just in case anybody was wondering. Oh god. Ah, there's literally no way to survive that. Because you fall to the ground. There is no ground. Wonderful. So you either have to be, like, not over lava. Sometimes it don't work out like that. Die, please. Like, what the hell happened there? There is literally ground right there. There is ground right here, okay? Like, why am I falling into the lava? There is literally not even lava there. I'm using literally the way that a white girl in in South California uses it. I hate myself. It's cuz it's cuz I'm flying, which sucks cuz I'm not even flying. This is it's you literally just throw them into the lava and if that doesn't work then you're screwed. Goodbye. Bye-bye. Yeah, whatever. I hate this. I hate this. I actually just hate this because the monkeys suck. I hate them all. Try it, dudes. It's like a rhythm game. Except it's shooting monkeys and they fall and die in lava. Good. They deserve it, just in case anybody had any doubts. And they reach all the way to the top of the screen! Alright, I figured it out. They freaking nab ya. So you gotta you gotta mash the spin button if you want to live. Which I I really do want to live. Freaking idiots. I hate this guy. Anyway, yeah, there we go, there we go, there we go. Oh boy. Scary. Okay, he's gonna cower there. I guess we'll just not worry about that. Let's just not worry about that for right now. Is this a new area that I haven't been in? Pretty sure I've been in here before. Yeah, jump into the lava, you freaking idiot. I hate that! Very fun, very fair! 
So glad I could see that monkey coming at my face. Very nice. Anyway, whatever. Hey, look. Hey, look. It's that area I was in. Let me just, uh... This'll work. Nice. Oh, not very nice. Let's get the heck out of here. Oh, wonderful. This. Why are these fellers even here? I hate them, and they deserve death. Why? GET ME OFF THE WALL! There we go. Very fun, very fair. I just love it when there's a monkey right on top of my fucking head that I can't see. Wonderful. Just love when that happens. And guess what we get thrown straight into? Guess what we get thrown straight into? Straight into... ANOTHER BS BOSS FIGHT! And you know what else is after that? SOMETHING ELSE THAT'S BS! You'll see. You'll see. It'll all be in this episode. It's the bullshit episode. Not rated for children, let me tell ya. This is the fucking adults only. I fucking hate this boss. This, this span of maybe 15 minutes is the most bullshit portion of the entire fucking game. Let me tell ya. Alright. What the hell? Oh yeah, that's an attack. Oh yeah, that's also an attack. Let me spin, please! Let me get the fuck out of here, maybe! I don't know, let me do the shit that I'm supposed to be able to do! Just a thought! No, maybe you don't have a massive living hitbox! Haha! <laughs> very cool, Kanye! Thank you! Thank you, Kanye! Very cool! This is fun to have to fucking dodge! Thank you! I'm gonna get the fucking hell out! Die, please! Please die! And I can't even shoot him with frickin' Alphonse. <laughs> Whatever. I hate this thing. And I'm gonna hate it even more later, because it's li it's literally the most BS portion of this game. Let me tell ya. We'll get there. We'll get there. You'll see. But only after I fucking die here one more time and I have to fight the whole frickin' boss again. Don't worry. It'll be from damage, too. Don't worry, man. I'll do it. I'll do it. Don't worry about me not having to fight the boss again and edit it down. Oh, thank God. Thank Christ. I'm holding on for dear life here. Watch me. Alright. Here's the bullshit. Who's ready for more BS? I sure am. Woo! That's right. It's a frickin' rodeo. And like all rodeo machines, it's rigged. Here's the idea, right? Move up and down. Yeah, up and down are definitely the two directions right here. Also, there are a bunch of freaking obstacles that you can't see until you're up upon them. Because one entire half of the screen will be full of obstacles that you can't hit for fear of taking damage. Also, it's, it's not a fluid thing. You're on tracks. Why am I on tracks for this? Okay. Alright, am I able to still move up and down? Yes, I am still able to move up and down. But I've gotta I've gotta move up for fear of I, now I gotta move down for fear of hitting spikes. Very cool, Kanye, thank you. And now I gotta move up for fear of hitting the ground. Thank you, Kanye. Very cool. I guess this is why it's on tracks, but still. It's kind of a crappy section of the game. 
Alright, hey, first try. Still, don't like it. I really don't like this section of the game. Oh, hey, Twig, thanks, man. Boof. Alright, and now on to a section of the game that I can actually appreciate. Oh my gosh. Welcome to Mezos. Oh my gosh. Welcome to the Mesosphere, my fellows. We should probably go check it out. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. Just a thought. Why'd the screen go dark? Okay, weird. But, like, not dark enough for me to not be able to see. Interesting. Anyway... Let's... Hey, wait up. Hey, it's Twig. Bora. That was a close call, huh, guys? We did it. You know it. Yeah, we're a, t we're a great team. No, we're not. That's a bra moment. That is a bra moment. Certified. Didn't realize what the pirates were up to. I just wanted someone to hang out with. We don't want your company. That's right. Worse company. Not right, guys. No, we don't we don't really care, to be honest. Anyway. Let us go. Let's go! For a moment. Otis, I don't care either. And it's not like you're going to hear any words out of my mouth, man. Come on. Suit yourselves, but I don't have to put up with this. I'm going back to Belly. Okay, bussy boy. See you later. There he goes. Didn't know he could teleport at will. I thought it was kind of just a summoning thing, but you know. Yes, he is gone. That is a great idea, Twig. Jump on home. Fly home, buddy. I work alone. Or, I guess with Alphonse now. I suppose is the, the one that I work with. Hey, bud. Oh, I'm um, high. This is awkward. You're welcome. Hey, I think I'm gonna need your help with this. For a moment. Need some help over there? Yes, I do. If you help me get back home, I'll help you get out of here. Sounds good, Twig. I, w I will absolutely not tear your get up. Don't worry. Also, you don't even have to aim for the rings is the funny thing. You can just kind of do that at any given time. Okay, wonderful. Can I please, like... Okay, if you aim, then you can scroll the screen further, which is nice and all. This is what I was talking about, man. I don't have to deal with this crap. I'm, I'm popping a cap in him. Not that it burns me anything, but I'm finna. Yeah, whatever. Die. Now we wait. You know, for the, there we go. Very cool. Thank you, Kanye. I say that way too frickin' much, but I don't care. Anything over here? No. Alright. Alright. Hey, it's Mezos. What a beautiful place. I think I can make my way home from here. Thanks for the ride, fellas. You're welcome, Twig. I think I'll figure out what might be over here. Hey, look, a, a chest. Interesting stuff. I wonder what could be up here. Oh, I can't fly that high because we're in the frickin' mesosphere, my fellas. The oxygen's too dang thin. 
either I'm not getting enough oxygen to move my muscles, or it's not dense enough for me to fly through. That, honestly, that might... It's not... Actually, yeah, that might be a thing. It being not dense enough to fly through. Because the whole point of a uh, bird... If, if, in case you didn't know, birds' bones are hollow. And that is because... Um, uh, that makes their bones li not lighter than air. I'm not going to say lighter than air, because that's the stupidest thing I could say. Whoops. Yeah, try it again, pal. Try it! Come at me! Yeah. It's what I thought, man! Anything up here? No. Okay. Now, I think we may get to something interesting. But probably not, actually. No, yeah, actually, we won't get into anything interesting. We'll, we'll probably kind of sort of get there, but not really. That is not an area I can go to. I have to go this direction. What's with this keyhole? That is not the left trigger, that's the right trigger. Weird! That's... that's odd. What could be over here? You know what? We'll check that out later. I'm sure that Getty would love to see it. And that I just have no idea what it could possibly be. Maybe. Shh, it's my family, they're in trouble. Dang. Our inspection is over for today. Won't try anything stupid. As long as you don't cause trouble, the occupation will be over before you know it. Well, dang! Pirate occupation? That's not good. They destroyed half our furniture. Bruh. That is good. They didn't find the wine cellar. That is, that is a good thing, let me say. Aw, oh, man. Didn't think the pirates would cause trouble for me. Bruh moment. Alright. On the next episode, we are going to be helping out Twig's family. Which is probably going to take a while. We should investigate Syria, but I don't like this area, so we should be very careful. Well, I shall stay out of sight for now. Dang right you freaking should. Anyway, on the next episode, we are going to be investigating more in Mezos. In the main area that Twig's family lives in. Which is this one. This is a nice pirate door, but we're going to talk to Twig's family inside Twig's house, which is this one. Nice! What a nice little abode. Anyway, on the next episode, Twig's family, we get to talk to Twig's. It'll be like that sometimes. Like, comment, and subscribe, or I will seriously scream. I, I will scream even more. It gets so much easier from here on out. But still, I will scream. Goodbye! Yeah, I hope that one. I thought it was pretty funny.